Dear sisters and brothers in Christ Jesus, On this 27th Sunday of Ordinary Time, we are invited to reflect on the theological virtue of faith. The Gospel test of today begins with the request of the Apostles to Jesus, Increase our faith. And Jesus replies, If you had faith like a mustard seed, you could say to this mulberry tree, Be uprooted and planted in the sea, and it would obey you. Through this image, Jesus indicates to them that for God a tiny bit of faith can transform a whole life. Nothing is impossible with God. He compares this little bit of faith to a mustard seed. The apostles have well understood the great need of faith. This is the only thing they ask of Jesus. Increase our faith. This request is truly wonderful because they do not ask for material goods or privileges, but the grace of faith, that is to recognize God as our only master and creator. Faith is the foundation of our Christian life. Without faith, we see only the ugly and dark side of life. There are days when our faith seems small and weak. There are other times when our faith seems strong and deep. Faith is about knowing what God asks of us. Faith liberates us and helps us to see the power and love of God at work in our lives. In response to the request of the apostles to increase their faith, Jesus tells them the parable about the unprofitable servant who comes back from plowing the field and proceeds straight away to prepare supper for his master and to wait on him while he eats. Only after the master's needs are fully satisfied does the master then give the servant leave to attend to his own need for food and rest. Dear friends, how does this parable answer the request of the apostles for an increase of faith? Jesus is saying that if we have mature faith, we would put the will and the pleasure of God first in our lives at all times. If we have faith, we will not grumble and complain that we have been working for God all day long. Rather, we will forget ourselves and work ourselves to death in God's service knowing that God will come to our aid when and how He deems right. The Gospel of this 27th Sunday seems to be teaching us that we must wait on the Lord. We should not presume simply that because we cry out to God, then God will do exactly what we want. No servant would expect to come into the house where he or she works and have the employer wait on him on or her. Yet, that is exactly how we seem to expect, to expect God to be with us at times. So much of the teaching of the Holy Scriptures is about the necessity to persevere in prayer without expecting any kind of immediate results. We are invited to put all of our trust in God. 
we are invited to live each day with an awareness that God is in our lives. We may not see it, but that is not important. The attitude of faith is much more important. And in the Gospel today, Jesus suggests that we can merit the kingdom of God by the fulfillment of our ordinary daily duties done with a little faith, even if that faith is only as big as a mustard seed. It is faith that converts ordinary things of daily life into extraordinary signs of the kingdom of God. Jesus says, when you have done all you have been told to do, say, we are merely servants, we have done no more than our duty. Friends, be sharers of the word of God by sharing this video to your friends. God bless you.